Alright, hey people, anyone who ever watches my videos. Today I'm going to be showing a tutorial on no lights in Sony Vegas without any overlays or um, picture overlays or anything. So, I looked on YouTube to show you guys what a picture overlay would look like. So right here I got my clip in, so I just put my clip with a little bit of color correction, then added a new video track, and then set a source, al source alpha right there I put it on add so anything black is transparent so here is the clip so right now it's on black but um this trick doesn't look very good when it's on complete black but it looks great on like Call of Duty real life stuff like that but first I'm gonna show you um some guy he did the real one in Vegas in uh, After Effects I mostly always use After Effects, but I'm just showing everyone my old tricks I used to use in Vegas until I got After Effects because I didn't really know how to get it yet. So here is No Lights. That looks like a download. So this is what the normal one would usually look like as an overlay. See, it doesn't look amazing. It doesn't look that good either. I don't think it looks amazing. You could obviously change the colors and stuff, like just by using this you rotate the hue on color secondary then it just changes the color that's how a lot of people do it but I think that just looks um, kinda fake because it's not the real one and if you, any of you guys want the real one you just go to After Effects but right now I'm gonna show you how to do the little trick in Vegas so it's pretty simple you go to media generators uh, let's go white and black uh, some of you guys have probably seen this but I found a different way how to do it. So what you want to do is adjust this a bit s smaller, oh, just a little bit. Now you're gonna, oh crap, wrong color. Sorry, you go. You make sure it's clicked on one. Now you want it to be a really kind of bright color of whatever color you want to be. So if you want to be dark blue, you want to get the light color of dark blue like right here. But I want it to be kind of like a tealish color right now. So it's a light color of that, and there's to uh, pan and crop this is what you do so on pan and cropping you go on pan and crop and you want to adjust these things this is the regular one that most of you are accustomed to this is manual you can just move it around but this also has left and right and up and down so first we're going to move up and down we're going to put it down right to where this middle you, you might not be able to see it but there's like a middle light that makes it brighter in the middle and you want it to be near that spot. And you want it to be in the sky too, because um, that's how normal lights usually are worked and used as. And then you want it to be moved a little bit to the like right or left. It just makes it look nicer, like it's a sun or something. So next, after you've done that, you add the little trick. And my little trick is color curves. It might sound weird, but it's a cool trick. So you're going to do is drag this way far out, like that. It makes it kind of brighter. And you want it to be curved just like that. Then you want to add this one kind of far back like that. Just keep adjusting it. And I think uh, you can just get it to look great. So far it looks decent. The best looking color is like orange and stuff because that's what most people use. Right there, that's a great color too. Alright, so if you liked the tutorial, please like and comment and favorite the video. Thanks for watching, and comment on any more tutorials in Vegas you guys want, anything you've wanted to learn or anything. Thanks for watching, and peace.